Novina to Colletin Infant Jesus Prayer for Every Day Colletin Infant Jesus, may you be glorified for the miracles and graces that you generously bestow upon all who with faith and trust come to you. You, O oh Jesus, are not unfamiliar with suffering, pain and sadness. And because you are love and mercy, you comfort all in distress, crestfallen and suffering, generously granting them your graces. Therefore, I trustfully beg you to help me in my need. Do not look at my unworthiness and sins, but in your great mercy hear me. O sacred infant Jesus, I worship you with all my whole heart and love you above everything. Be with me and bless me. Holy Virgin Mary, you who first of all humans adored the child in God, teach me how to honor and love your divine Son, and as you were the best of mothers of divine child, be our mother and lead us to Jesus. Amen. Ninth day. Many votive offerings and letter of thanks reflect how generous infant Jesus is in granting graces, even though they present only a small fraction of the graces received. The majority of recipients do not leave any visible sign that their pleas were heard. Here are a few more examples of miracle curves. In 1977, Lyme got into the eye of 10-year-old Jack from Pławnica near Kłodzko, which caused chemical burns. The doctors at hospital decided that one eye could probably be saved. His broken-hearted grandmother started to pray the novena to infant Jesus. On the third day of the novena, the boy's eyes began to heal. On the seventh day, Jack regained vision in both eyes. Monika Krajewska was born in 1984 in Tarnów with Cele, the type of spine b -fide. The doctors said the baby would never be able to walk or would walk with great difficulty. When Monika was one year old, she could not stand on her feet. Then her family turned with trust to Colletin Infant Jesus, fervently praying for help. Their prayer was answered. When the letter of thanks was being written, Monika was three years old and running around like other healthy children. In 1980, Maria G. from Wołomin fell over on the street and hit her head on the scarp. She had a confusion and lay unconscious all day. When she regained consciousness, she remembered that she had infant Jesus water. With great faith, she poured it on her head and felt that she was immediately healed. The so-called infant Jesus water has been used often with miraculous effects by worshippers of infant Jesus for a long time. It is made by submerging the statue of infant Jesus in regular water. Let those examples encourage us to trust in infant Jesus' help, who through this statue gives so many graces. We can receive everything we ask for with great faith and trust and if it is in accordance to God's will. Adorations Divine Child, you are the Son of Eternal God 
and out of love for us you became the Son of Man. For this we adore you and love you. Divine Child, you are the world of Almighty God, while for us you became flesh and established your dwelling among us. For this we adore you and love you. Divine Child, you came into the world for our salvation. For this we adore you and love you. Petitions Divine Child, coming into this world, you brought us peace and love. Have mercy on us. Jesus, Divine Child, grant that we may love you wholeheartedly now and always. Colleton Infant Jesus, teach me to always choose what is pleasing to God and grant me the grace I ask of you in this novena. Offerings Divine Child, I offer you my soul, heart and body. I offer you all my actions, thoughts, feelings and desires, all that I am and all that I have. I offer my whole self to you. Remember, O Jesus, that I am yours. Guard me as you would guard your own eye and grant me that I may be yours forever. Amen. Prayer at the end of each day. Almighty eternal God, who loved us so much that you sent your only begotten Son to the earth, grant that we may with great reverence adore holy mysteries of infant Jesus and follow in his footsteps so that we may always please you and obtain eternal life. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.